गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग गुड इट्स मी सर रेहान यू सर एंड टुडे यू आर हैविंग योर एट लेक्चर ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स इन आर प्रीवियस लेक्चर्स वी स्टार्टेड यूनिट टू दैट इज इंटीजर्स रैशनल नंबर्स एंड रियल नंबर्स एंड वी स्टडीड द रूल्स फॉर द एडिशन एंड द सप्रेक्शन ऑफ द इंटीजर्स इन टूडेज लेक्चर वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी द रूल्स फॉर द मल्टीप्लीकेशन एंड द डिविजन ऑफ द इंटीजर्स सो लेट्स बिगेन Now let's start the rules for the multiplication of the integers. The first rule is that the product of the two integers with the same signs is positive. It means that if I am going to multiply two by four, so I will get eight in the answer. Similarly, if I am going to multiply minus two by minus four, then again I am going to get eight in the answer. It means that if the same signs are multiplied, the product is always positive. And the second rule is that The product of the two integers with different signs is negative. Means if I am going to multiply minus two by four, so I will get minus eight in the answer. Means one number was positive, one number was negative. When I am going to multiply a positive by a negative number, so my answer will be negative. Now let's have a quick summary for the rules of the multiplication. Positive multiply by positive will be positive. Negative multiply by negative will be also positive. Positive and negative are going to multiply. It will be negative. And negative and positive are going to multiply. It will be negative. Now let's have some practice. Seven multiplied by minus three will be minus twenty-one. Here you can see that one number was positive, another number was negative. Negative and positive, your product will be negative. Four multiplied by three equals to twelve. It means that. Four was also positive and three was also positive. Again, I'm going to get the answer positive. Positive twelve will be the answer. Minus five multiplied by five means positive and negative. So I'll get the answer in negative means minus twenty-five. Minus seven minus two. You can see that both of the numbers are negative. Minus minus equals to plus. Two times seven is fourteen. Your answer will again be positive because when the numbers are multiplied with the same sign, the product is always positive. In the fifth example, you can see that minus eight multiplied by minus eight means minus minus equals to plus eight times eight is sixty four. Again, both of the numbers were having the same sign, so your product will be positive. Students, you know that uh, the rules for the multiplication and the divisions are same. Let's explore. The rules for the division are exactly the same as those for the multiplication. If we were to take the rules for the multiplication and change the multiplication signs to the division sign, we would have an accurate set of the rules for the division. It means that if we are just going to replace the sign of the multiplication by division, so the same rules are applicable for the division as well. Now here are the rules for the division of the integers. The quotient of the two integers with the same signs is positive. It means that if I am going to divide minus four by minus four, so I'll get A positive answer that is one. If I am going to divide two by two, so again I am going to get the positive answer as one. And another rule is that the quotient of the two integers with a different sign is negative. It means that if I am going to divide minus two by two, so I'll get the answer in negative. That is minus one. Means if one number is positive and the other number is negative, so your answer will be negative. Here we are having a quick summary for the rules for the division. If a positive number is divided by the positive number, so we'll get a positive number in the answer. If a negative number is divided by a negative number, so again we will be getting a positive number in the answer. If positive number is divided by the negative number, so your answer will be negative. If the negative number is divided by the positive number, so again your answer will be negative. Now let's have the practice for the division. 16 divided by minus 2, so you will get in the answer 8, and that would be negative because one number was negative and another number was positive. Minus 42 divided by minus 6. Again, both of them are having the same sign, so your answer will be a positive number. That is 7. Minus 18 divided by 9. One number is positive, another number is negative, so your answer will be negative. That is minus 2. 40 divided by 8, so you will get 5. 5 will be positive because both of the numbers were positive. 20 divided by minus 5 one number is positive another number is negative so your answer will be negative so class today we studied about the rules for the multiplication and division of the integers i hope that you all understand it very clearly for more practice you can go through your book exercise different questions are given over there go through them 
and make sure that you are practicing it on daily basis so that you are not going to face any sort of problem in future so all of you stay safe stay home thank you so much